Hi, welcome to the Northern Virginia Market Watch, brought to you by RBI, Real Estate Business Intelligence, an MRIS company. We're going to dig into the most recent numbers from the Northern Virginia housing market, which includes the counties of Arlington, Fairfax, Falls Church, Fauquier, Loudoun, Manassas Park, Manassas, and Prince William. Let's jump right in. Like all regions in the area, home sales in Northern Virginia remained strong in January, but to a lesser extent. There were 2,875 pending sales for the month, an increase of 2.3% from a year ago. That's the 17th month of the last 22, where we've seen more signed purchase agreements than during the same month the year prior. But lately, the increases have been much smaller than those seen in other parts of the region. Regardless, strong sales and weak new listings means there's a lot fewer houses available for sale than there used to be. At the end of January, there were just under 7,000 houses for sale, half of what it was a year ago. That's led to stabilizing home prices. Northern Virginia's January median sales price of $310,000 was a strong 16% higher than a year ago. That's the seventh consecutive month that the median sales price was actually higher than it was a year ago. I know, I know, that used to be a pretty ho-hum and normal thing, but you gotta remember, we're just coming off three consecutive years of dropping prices. Right now, ho-hum and normal feel pretty good. It's not all good news, though. Two big aspects of what's been driving the local market in the right direction the last several months are the federal homebuyer tax credit and extremely low mortgage rates. Unfortunately, both of those market boosters may be near their eventual end. First, the tax credit expires on April 30th and likely won't be extended. Second, the Federal Reserve intends to stop buying mortgage-backed securities in the near future, a move which will likely lead to an increase in interest rates. Unless these changes are effectively offset by other economic improvements, we can expect downward pressure on home sales in the months ahead. We'll be keeping a close eye on where things go. That's the Northern Virginia Market Watch for this month. Check back next month for the latest. 